are having an IDP program session here and it's the third in a row. Uh, do you think that there is any impact that this kind of programs uh, uh, provide to the people? Uh, I, don't, I, don't, I don't see any, any impact, particularly because uh, this is a program that was been uh, designed by other people and then people have not have not been given an opportunity to put their input. So today they're saying it's a draft, so we're still waiting for to hear from our own people from this ward what they will be saying to this draft. What do you think is the major challenge that we are here today for the IDP and it is still in a draft form? What do you think? Is it a question of capacity in terms of those that should design it? Yeah, people that are, are designing these uh, IDPs that are that, that incompetent because it's only few people that design these people and they're not from this side. They don't even, even know the challenges within these uh, uh, villages or the challenges within our wards. People that are designing this, they're staying far from us. They're coming from Bushburg Ridge as far as that side. So they don't know the challenges that our, our, our community members are facing every day. As, as a representative of the economic freedom fighters, what do you think should be done at a political level to ensure that this is uh, this is brought to a standstill? Uh, we are saying that this IDP must go back from, to, to, to a drawing board where people will be given chance to put anything that they think they want from their watch so that it can be transferred to be a, 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 an IDP program. But for now, we don't see anything that is going to benefit our people for the next coming five years. What do, you th what do you think should be done to ensure that at least the people are involved in as much as the constitution says? People must be given chance to make submissions of any development that they want from their own words. Not few individuals in offices planning for the, the communities. They must give communities chance to put and submit whatever they want from their own words. As a representative of the EFF, what is your message, your overall message to this kind of problem? So what do you think should be done, in fact, to, to, to ensure that people benefit from these programs? We are saying that uh, this IDP must go back. People must be given a chance to make submissions of any development program that they want from their own work. So this thing of few individuals just come here, present documents saying that this is what we think it must happen here. It's, it's a nonsense thing. It must go back and then people must submit whatever they want. For example, we are having a community hall here. The budget says something different. So we're saying people must be given a chance to make their own submissions, challenges that face them every day of life. In terms of uh, what, I, what we thought is that the target was 300, do you think uh, they have achieved to organize people to come at that number? Our people, our people here are not as that we have expected them. The reason is that uh, these programs in, in future, we, that's why we, we as the EFF, we even suggested that how about we do these programs on on, on weekends that all our people can, can come and participate. And then the, their response was that they are below time, so they wanted to, this program to be done. But we're saying that our people are not here in their full numbers. What is your last message to the people as a representative of the Economic Freedom Fighters going forward? I'm saying that people, our people, every time, whenever there's a program like this, they must come in their numbers and raise genuine challenges that face them every day. People must stop that thing of saying every time, whenever there are meetings, they don't go and then they complain after. They must attend meetings, programs of the, of the municipality, and make their own inputs, make their own submissions to every, every gathering. Thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you very much.